Monday is the solar eclipse, and parts of southeast Missouri will be in complete totality, which has some cities gearing up for large crowds. City of Poplar Bluff is listed as one of the best places to watch the eclipse this year. Tonight, our ABC 17's Nia Henson joins us live from Columbia. Nia, you'll actually be in Poplar Bluff on Monday, where it's expected to be doubling the city's population. Megan and Lucas, Steve Halter with the Poplar Bluff Chamber of Commerce tells me 40,000 extra people are expected to come to the city on Monday. He says people from other countries have already started trickling in, but he says the city does have plans in place for these large crowds. The fact that we're, we're going to be clear, and clear viewing area and, and the fact that we've, um, we, you know, we have four minutes and 11 seconds in certain parts of our town of mm -hmm. totality. It's just got, it's gone crazy. 40,000 people is what the city's Chamber of Commerce President Steve Halter says the city is expecting for Monday solar eclipse. The southeast Missouri city with a population of 16,000 is one of the Missouri cities that will be in the path of totality, with darkness expected to last over four minutes. Halter says people have already started pouring into the city, including some who made a fairly lengthy trip. We, we've had people as far away as Japan, Brazil, um, Italy um, contacting us. Man, there's just been people from every state in the country either call us or already come in today. Halter says the city will have 20 viewing stations across the city, but is encouraging people to go to the high school where there'll be a live band, food trucks, and the Kansas City Chiefs mascot. He tells me police and the highway patrol will be patrolling that area. Halter says the city's police and sheriff's department will also have people working overtime to help manage traffic, but says he recommends you get there as early as you can. I've been telling everybody it's between 10 and 4, wherever you are is where you're going to be. And we've also been encouraging people that don't leave right after totality ends. About two hours ago, I also spoke with Clark Parrott with the Missouri State Highway Patrol, and he tells me they've been preparing for these large crowds since 2017 and are ready for Monday. Again, I will be in Poplar Bluff on Monday bringing you live coverage, but if you don't want to make the drive, you can also watch it right here at Hickman High School. Reporting live in Columbia, Nia Henson, ABC 17 News.